Have you ever done a professional show like this? This? Yeah. I've never done a show like this. Yeah. I've done well, professional shows. Welcome to the big leagues. This is the big <laughs> leagues. <laughs> How's it going, guys? Welcome to another edition of It's a Hawaii Thing. I'm Lanai, and that's Brooke Lee. Today, we have a very special guest on the show. Uh, he's been a friend of mine for a, a very long time. I want to say 25 years, maybe. Yeah. Right we'll find that. out the exact time. Shh. I didn't introduce you yet. <laughs> Our guest <laughs> has his own TV show, so he thinks he's going to take over this one. Uh, it's called The Champ Show, I think. It's been airing in Hawaii for about 62 years. Wow. Uh, he's an MC of all kinds. He does events, weddings. He's even done funerals. Uh, we do stand-up comedy together for a long time. And you do a lot of things for a long time. He's been our, well, <laughs> his show's been on 62 years. Wow. You know what I mean? okay. But he was uh, me and Augie's MC for years as we traveled all over the West okay. Coast. Ladies and gentlemen, the guy he even opened for Eddie Griffin, Champ oh, Kaneshiro. How you doing, Whoa. Champ? You know, I'm so glad you're still alive. It's a treat. Thank you. Because it's a dream come true. <laughs> because <laughs> one, to be alive. Second, to be with you, Miss Universe. <laughs> For real. He can come on all the shows. I, I said I'm thank sit over there. thankful that Thanks. he's alive because he brother had a heart attack. And, wow, you're just going to come in out I, the gate. Well, we right booked off. him, and I was going to be upset if he didn't show up. Right. You know what I mean? So he's healthy now, and he's doing. <laughs> you're healthy now, right? I'm better than I was uh, four weeks ago for dang show. Yes. That's good. Wait, yes. hang on. I got to catch up. Go ahead. So this happened recently? Four weeks ago. March 29th. Wow. Yeah. Down, okay. Down. And I would tell him for years, I Is said. The, like, it doesn't comedy have a thing about too soon isn't that yeah, like two a, days it's two days oh that's yeah the you gotta wait off? a couple okay, days i think it is yeah but oh. th but this guy i got a text early i got like 10 texts early in the morning champ had a had a heart attack had a heart attack like goes down the from line from him like he was no, multitasking from, from or? friends oh, okay and got i'm it. and i'm looking at my text and i'm trying to figure out is he alive no one said is he is he alive or dead yet <laughs> so i'm getting all choked up and I'm Aww. getting emotional. You know how emotional I get. Yes. So I decided, you know what? I'm just going to FaceTime his phone. Maybe his wife will, will answer. So I, I FaceTime. Yeah. And there he is laying in bed. He goes, what? <laughs> I go, was I in the hospital? He was in the hospital. And I, I said, would hope so. You were I, in the hospital. I said, are you, are you okay? And he's like, yeah, yeah, I'm okay. I had a heart attack and blah, blah, blah. I said, oh, man, thank God. Because you still mm -hmm. owe me 500 bucks. That's what okay. he kept saying. <laughs> so that's, that's Can the I, kicker. Yeah. I was yeah. waiting for the kicker. But so. I'm glad you're here, brother. Thanks, man. Thank what you. happened? Uh, I don't know. I don't remember a thing. That's probably the beauty of it all. You lucky, you know. That's just so crazy. Apparently went golfing. Oh, okay. Lay down and uh, got up. Was talking to people, but I don't remember that. I don't remember huh. going to the course or paying for the golf. Uh, went home, rode an ambulance, got a stint. Should we shout out the hospital? Oh, polymomy? Dr. Dang saved my life, Dr. Dang. Dr. Dang. Dang. Now he's giving me this medication to try and kill me. <laughs> <laughs> so I said, you ever take medication? Yin and yang, you yeah, know? Yin yeah, and yeah. So he wants you to come back in. Yeah. Uh, yeah. So dang, I went, I went, Dr. Dang. I went and saw him, and then uh, he gave me some meds. I told him it. You know, you're a pretty healthy guy. That's why I stay active. Yeah, I, you know how I eat. But he eats, I eat. he eats. So we'll sit down and he'll have a cup of coffee and put six packets or maybe eight packets of sugar in it, oh. and then order a coke I make when it he's done. Like, I make uh, it taste like ice cream. Got bro. it. Yeah. Got and it. then he always eats snacks and desserts. But like your Instagram yeah. feed is full of stuff. Like you yeah. eat like yeah. a crazy person too. Did they ever tell you don't believe what you see on social media? Oh, you yeah. lie. How do you drink no. your you coffee? Heard it here. I, I don't know. I was raised Mormon, so I don't drink coffee. Really? Yeah. yeah. Soda, Pepsi, no. Coke, all that. No, no. I've never. Uh, I don't drink soda either. Uh, I just drink water and like and fresh juice or whatever. Hey, yeah. good food though. He, yeah. This guy eats pure sugar. Sugar. Mm. Yeah. Like so desserts. did he cut you out? No. He just. <laughs> You're still <laughs> eating sugar. <laughs> to give you medication to to, to to thin all that out. The yeah. blood thinner, the uh, cholesterol, okay. the. To compensate. Yeah. Got it. So not one city tell me watch what I eat, right? So I went huh. to see, Doctor. Dang. Jody. Okay. The keto prescription. Oh. Kaleo's doing the same thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Kaleo needs to. Yeah, he, you see. Why does Kaleo need You'll to? You'll see when he comes in. So wow. What You've never seen his body. No. <laughs> Something to behold. Yeah. Okay. It is. So you're doing a keto diet now? Yeah. Yeah, how's it working? Uh, it's tough. I believe there's no sugar in keto, correct? Tough withdrawals. Okay. That's my that's biggest thing. So no rice. No carbs. No carbs. Low, carbs. Low to no. I was in LA for 30 years. That's a f Wednesday. Yeah. No carbs inside. That's it. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, they don't do carbs. You don't eat LA. much either. I do. Not that Twice. much. Twice. No. <laughs> yeah. 
You look like you <laughs> everything twice. You look like you work out a lot. Uh, I don't. <laughs> He's just being keep, sarcastic just right keeping, now. Yeah. No, I'm not. So what you been up to? If I was to say you, yeah, look like you've been working out a lot. Uh huh. That's sarcastic. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Let's see. Anyway, go ahead. What's up? What, what you been up to? Uh, Besides you know trying to stay healthy. All right. So the champ show is still on. Yeah. We've been on 16 years this year. Because right. I know because my oldest grandson, Noah, is 16. Okay. okay. And uh, we've gone from two shows a month to one every weekend now. So one every week. Wow. So thank a lot of people for yeah. supporting us. You know. Good for you. Yeah. That's Otherwise, uh, back in the gym, back on the golf course. Where do they watch your show at? What? Tell everybody where they watch your show at. OC 16, 7 o'clock in the morning, 3.30 yeah. in the afternoon, 1 o'clock in the morning. Three well, you, times a day, you, seven days. That's never done, the beauty of OC You've never done 16. this type of show before, have you? What, this? Yeah. No. Yeah, exactly. It's a podcast. We're going to be right back. We'll take a commercial. I'm Don't go anywhere. All right now. Champ is hanging Miss out universe. with us. <laughs> Miss America. It's a Hawaii Miss thing. Miss Hawaii. <laughs> Bringing you what matters. Viewers can receive the Star Advertiser digital full access subscription for just $9.95 per month. Go to StarAdvertiser.com and click on subscribe. Use the code AHI THING. HEC Medical Clinic, Dr. Aries Oda, Hawaii's number one laser weight loss center for weight loss, reverse diabetes, and heart disease. Call today for your limited time special, only $37. Lose one to two inches instantly. Welcome back to It's a Hawaii Thing. Champ is hanging out with us today. Yes. Uh, Champ, you uh, opened for Eddie Griffin for a little while. You know what, man? He was, uh, yes, three times. Was He's, this pre-Eddie Griffin being Eddie Griffin? No, no this it was, was all Eddie oh, It was in the height. middle of his, yeah. Oh, okay. And because. Um, not that, Eddie, that you're not at height anymore. I don't want to get hater mail that yeah. you're no, always you at should, height. I was just going to say you should see his YouTube channel. Have you watched his YouTube channel? On occasion. Because he's something. very deep. He's an intelligent man, very. number one. He's a genius. Um, and actually. he has no fear. None. And you got you got to watch. Have you seen it? Yeah. He talks about everything. Everything. Every day he'll bring up an issue. Oh really? And but he gives you a really good perspective right. Right. of things. Have you talked to him lately? No, I haven't. I know you record. You used to record his conversations. <laughs> I was the fly <laughs> on the wall, and I still play them back. Yeah. Wait. Because meaning that you're in a conversation with him, and you're just in his suite, like between shows. They're and on. He doesn't know that you're recording him. Yeah. Or? Well, well, now he does. You tell him. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yeah, what state was this in? Because it's something. Here. You can't do here. that. Oh, I think that's legal it was here. here. Yeah. Some states it's not. It was legal. in Kona, actually. So, you know, it's it's okay. It was legal, I think. In Kona. Okay. Yeah. How you do with his crowd? Uh, well, you know. What define what's his crowd? Black. He's going to tell you right black. now. Yeah. See, I'm a black man. Okay. Yeah. Let's get this out right let's, now. Let's for be you. clear. Yeah. You know, Marlene will tell you as she's over there. I'm a black man, okay. yeah. but I'm stuck in this body. Uh. <laughs> that's why. All every time Capone brings in these black comics, comics. Mm -hmm. I'm the open. Yeah. You know, wow. we've done Cedric, Smart Lawrence, Monique, Mike Epps. Yeah. Kat here Williams. in Hawaii? Here yeah, in Hawaii. Yeah. I'm sorry. You weren't here. I know. Yeah, well, this where is when do they this is at? Blaisdell. The really? Blaisdell Arena. 7, yeah. 000, Sell out every time. People. Really? Yeah, that's what I was telling you. We always talk about comedy when yeah. you weren't here. It, we were doing a lot of comedy. At the Blaisdell. Yeah. yeah. Not the concert Hewley, hall. At the both, arena. Both. Cedric. Uh, yeah. Uh, like yeah. Joe Coy's style. Like mm, sell out the arena. No, we did no. our own thing. We did it way before Joe Coy. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. So who the heck is Joe Coy? <laughs> <laughs> He's the new Filipino god, evidently. Joe Coy? Yeah, so Joe we, Coy? during that time period, this was 20 years ago. You yeah. were, you left already. Yeah. Mm -hmm. We were doing shows everywhere. Yeah. Big shows, yeah. too. And we got, we were lucky because it was me, Augie. There was only a handful of us, right. champ. But it was so fun. we got we got to open for a lot of these guys because yeah. they would they need openers. Yeah. Got it. And so because we don't have any comedy black, black comics, yeah. I'm it. Yeah, I uh, am it. So I come out and just slam them. Yeah, is that Gary? Have you heard of Gary Owens? Gary you guys heard of Gary Owens? He's one of the he's, biggest comics to date. He's the guy he's, going uh, around. Yeah, he he's a, a, a white comic, but he married a black girl, mm. and he only does black shows and uh, he kills that's my dream he Marry kills a black woman because he gives the perspective <laughs> <laughs> i went to radford high school right so you had the holly girls and the black girls i've dated holly girls but the black girls never took me serious yeah radford oh who, because who military can't take you serious, it's because the you military did, kids that are there yeah. at radford got it okay. yeah who did you like opening for it who'd you like uh, Eddie, touring was, with. Eddie, Eddie was probably the best. Well, for yeah. the for the mainland acts, but yeah. touring was when we do it with Augie. Yeah, you, me, him. 
that's the so golden trifecta right there yeah. yeah no but we had a whole bunch of other guys that would follow too huh? Well, yeah. not we we did with Augie for a long time, and then me, you, and Kaleo, Kaleo. did a long time Kaleo too. Kaleo was good too, man. Yeah. yeah, Isn't Kaleo with you on the Aloha Plate lunch? Or no, that's Sean. Sean, 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 yeah. Sean toured with <laughs> us. Sorry, too. Kaleo, don't hate on me. Sean, no, Sean should Sean be the one upset. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Sorry, correct. Sean. And Sean, Sean is really good now. Like Sean opened for Joe Coy for years. Right. He traveled with Joe Coy. But um, he started with us at Brew Moon. Yeah, he did. Yeah. Oh, yeah. okay. And, yeah. and the, all these guys did like five minutes, three minutes. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, but it was only lucky. after he got divorced mm -hmm. that, that his became show, funny. His, sh his act really became good because yeah. he talked about that process. Oh, yeah. You know, for like, pain. For, like pain. for like an hour. <laughs> yeah, it's funny. It was from somebody else's pain. pain. For like got an it. hour, right? Yeah. Yeah. It's like yeah. therapy. Good. Yeah. yeah. So I got some good stuff having the heart attack. I can't wait to bust it oh out. Oh, Lord. <laughs> yeah. Like people you said. You guys suffer for your art. You it, really it, do. Very, it, it really is. People say, champ, did you see the light? <laughs> did you smell the cotton candy? Did you? Did Are those you? the things they say? Yeah, they ask me. People uh -huh. ask me, did you see the light? Did you smell the cotton candy? Right. Like heaven smells like An cotton. NDE. Did the doll come from the Rainbow Bridge to greet oh, you? Yeah. I That's said no. But You're like, nope. But, but Dr. Dang did. <laughs> <laughs> but my feet was getting hot. <laughs> I started to sweat. <laughs> so You didn't see anything, though, huh? Nothing. Uh, Nothing. You're lucky. I should tell a lot people of people I, painful. Yeah. We got to take a quick break. Don't yeah. go anywhere. Champ, hanging out with us. It's a Hawaii Thanks, thing. Man. This universe. <laughs> this show is brought to you by Atlas Construction, Hawaii's number one builder for eight years in a row. Call them at 808-951-9500 for the quality and service you deserve today. <laughs> Welcome back to It's a Hawaii Thing. Champ is hanging out with us. He has a show called, uh, what is it called now? The, the Champ, Champ Show? The Champ Show. Come yeah. on, man. <laughs> yeah. Shoot. It's on 60-something years, you said. You ever yeah. learned the title by no, now? No, but you had another show called Body by well, Champ. Well, before that, it was Body Work yeah, and Champ and Friends. It evolved. Was that a workout show? It was. Really? Yeah. They give a little workout like tips. Like Gil? Like, like that guy to, Gil? No, guy? no, like how to get a heart attack. <laughs> no. I would go to the... I would, <laughs> Too soon, buddy. I would go to the uh, Gold's Gym, uh -huh. formerly The Gym, and right. I'd, Chris Faldo, Eric Yamashita, oh, all yeah. these trainers. We just do local workout tips for people who go in the gym. I golfed with Big E yesterday. I heard. Thanks yeah. for the invite. Yeah. We, yeah. They only invited the, the good guys. Don't Is you hate he, when he does that? He like yeah. posts him There's having some, his best life, yeah. and you're like sitting there going, wow, I could have gone to Miro. I could have gone to that restaurant. I invited you to Lobster. Mr. King, Thanks, like, like you guys would show up. This I guy would. invites me to places like an hour. Hey, what you doing in one hour? <laughs> uh, hello, I get a well, calendar to look at well, for a month. Shoot, I know you're True. not doing nothing. Man. It's lunchtime. <laughs> Make yeah. like he's busy. Yeah. Oh, I got a meeting. I, I got showed a up. Meeting. Yeah. I did. did. I showed up. He did. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And it was fun. What is your show about? My show is about places I like to go. Yeah. As far as for eating. Mm. Uh, places that are have provide the best services like you know pacific diamond yeah. you know you know ted you're yeah. not gonna get a better diamond from ted right uh the stereo guys that uh, I have. that's why you guys were talking about diamonds yeah, yeah. got yeah. it yeah yeah so everybody are you doing a commercial right now on this show well he's <laughs> like the og version of you <laughs> the I feel og like version he's older Wait, i older. feel like you watched yeah. him yeah. and then you were like i'm gonna kite i want him thank you miss yeah. universe oh. miss hawaii he, miss america are you older than him he is, but I I was in oh, way I was in entertainment way before him. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. Well, then he, maybe champ, you just you dialed said, it in. I, champ, how did we meet? You, did you come on my show? I think so. We did, man. You know, that's one of those memories. You, I, I I really don't remember how we met, but it was like we met a long time. Uh, he Jedi mind tricks people. Could have been too, back in the yeah, <laughs> Did I say that These I met you? These are not the comics you're looking mm. for. <laughs> I was at Twenty Four Fitness when Raul. I was doing Pump It Up. Oh, you pump o it up. Oleto. I was no, on a little. Yes. Remember? Yes, You guys I did came your out with show. your radio station. Yes, I came on your show. The very first time Lanai yes. and Augie came out. Where were you guys on I-94 at the time? Oh, no, this was This was 98.5. When, oh. when we started in yeah. 98.5, yeah. nobody knew what it was. He had a yeah. show on Olelo. Yeah. And then and we came on pump his it up. show. Wow. Yeah. Yes. Remember, we came out in our underwear. Yes. You no, guys, you and didn't. Then, uh, on Olelo? Lois. I think so. Lois, me and Shira was there trying to put you guys' clothes back on. You guys were undressing. you still have it? I don't you know. You should go look for it. Uh, I'm sure you guys are in. It. Let's be clear, Hawaii. You guys are in Bebedee's. Yeah, on like the Speedos. Olelos. They tried to undress, and she was covering them up, and then we went to break. Ha. But otherwise, Shock I was like jocks. 250 too at that time. Were you? And I was big. The hair was long. <laughs> <laughs> the hair was blowing well, we in the hair. wind. Yeah. Oh, that genre. God, plenty. Okay, it was okay. a long time ago. Plenty. Got I think it. We, it was like early 20s. Yeah. Most deaf Forte was coming out. Yeah. Brown skin. Yeah, because it was the three local boys, so that was early right. 20s. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. 
Yeah. So, but you don't know where. That's one of the first. Time, that's not the first time we met, though. No, it has to be, be somewhere been else. before that yeah. because then I invited you guys onto the show. So it's been a long time. <laughs> yeah. History. But, yeah. A lot of history. You got a lot of sh- got a lot of uh, opportunities to share precious moments with Uncle Mel Cabang. Yeah. Oh yeah. You know? We did. We traveled a lot together. Um, Champ, Kaleo, Augie. Where was Andy Jose. in all of this? Andy. And he was doing his own thing, but uh, we we did shows up here a while with Uh, him. He was up here. Was he on the mainland at this time, or was he here? No, he was just finishing the mainland. Oh, Mm -hmm. and coming Um, back. Yeah. Mm -hmm. What's your most memorable trip? Doing the comedy. That is appropriate for. Yeah, Uh, we always had something like we went up in Honoka'a for the first time. Uh, that was terrible. You know, <laughs> no, staying at the Honoka'a Hotel, bro. You know, they, no TV. We're, we're like doing no really nothing. good at this time. Yeah. And Augie had this thing about. What do you mean by being doing really well? Like we were killing it. Okay. Yeah, got yeah it. we were okay. like number staying one. Staying in hotels with AC and, oh, okay. and so, TVs. So there was a thing like whenever I booked shows, yeah. we all would stay at like a five star hotel. Oh, look at you, bougie. We did. <laughs> no, it wasn't about bougie. It ratchet. wasn't bougie. It was about good good negotiator. Okay. Because yeah. we never paid for it. All right. Yeah. And then Augie would True. book shows. Yeah. And we would stay at the Honoka'a brothel. Ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> okay, Honoka'a, don't come for What's him. It, it wasn't Maui a beautiful Maui seaside. Let's be clear. Oh. Legal, let's be clear. Listen, it wasn't a brothel. It was Before just... the Maui seaside was renovated, Yes. we stayed there many times. Yes. <laughs> yeah. Love it. But, but yeah. what was the name of that hotel or the place in Honoka'a? It was a like a halfway house or something. It was the Honoka'a. It's not a halfway house. The Honoka'a I'm gonna, Hotel. I'm going to tell you, it was so bad oh, that boy. I went to Walmart and bought sheets and wrapped myself in the sheets and went to bed because there I couldn't stay on Walmart the bed. There was no Walmart in Honoka. You <laughs> or, went to like or the KTM. Or exactly. Yeah, exactly. One of those places. Exactly. That's how bad it was. But I enjoyed it. Very memorable. So Salt of the you know, earth. They might Bougie. watch this Bougie show. I don't think it's open anymore. There's somebody burned <laughs> it down. No way. We'll be right Name back Lanai. hanging out with Champ. It's, <laughs> it's a Hawaii thing. Miss America. <laughs> Miss Hawaii. Miss Universe. Welcome back to It's a Hawaii Thing. Ooh. Champ is hanging out with us. We were talking about the... Uh, you know what? How much you love Honoka'a. You we know, love wait, wait. you, Honoka'a. I we love do. Honoka'a. We do. I said the place that we stayed was an old... like a. Uh, it's a hotel. No, it it's not a hotel, champ. Okay. It's a bed and breakfast. No, it was a hostel. <laughs> it was a hostel. It's all in That's the what selling. It was. It's all in the it selling. It was a hostel. Of it. Okay. Yeah. So it, we had to share bathroom. Yeah. One showers. Of those, share, share bathroom with everybody on that floor, kind yeah. of deal. Like a bed and breakfast. No. Okay. <laughs> not like a bed and breakfast. All right. But was that was very one of my most memorable. Why? See, because it was special to him. Oh, you know what happened that time too? We did a. TV interview and a guy came up with a pie and shoved it in Augie's face. Oh. Remember that was that same trip. Yeah, no, you guys I've, got yeah. accosted. No. You know what was what? Vegas. When no, wait, wait. You guys, wait, wait. You guys wait, had the wait. suite upstairs. Well, no, wait. The, wait, you're talking about your most our memorable trip. Yeah. No, I'm talking about Honoka. Let's finish oh. this Honoka story first. Okay. Remember, it was the time that the guy came and threw a pie in Who's his face. Who's the guy? Yes. And where did he get he a pie? Was in mad, he was an activist, well, mad about. Was it a woman? Something. I think oh, it was a woman about the Mahu jokes about oh. his kids. Oh. Yeah, she was like some activist, and she came and put a pie in the face. So that whole trip mm. was like a disastrous. Yeah. Huh. Thing. So how can yeah. that be your most memorable? No. Um, He's just being controversial, <laughs> yeah, and he know. loves Honoka. You asked me a question, I give I you the an answer. Yeah. Why are you trying to dispute my answer? All right, so, okay, you so what, what, what's the set? This is like the worst you show I've ever been on. You know what I go through every it's day with you this just guy. So wait, you, you just know, he's holding you back. <laughs> you just changed you your mind. Way better than him. this. Oh Come on, go sit in that chair. No, dude. This guy's a real I want to talk about Vegas then. Let's How talk was the about Vegas. Vegas. Trip? Vegas trip was cool because I was Which the one? first time I went in Vegas. Had Street Pharmacy Chris. Remember? He was oh, up there yes, with yes, us. yes, yes. We and brought these a whole guys plane did, uh, full of people. live broadcast from the suite. Yeah. And, oh, what yeah. suite was this? Uh, we did it cow. every year. We, we would fill up a plane with 300 people. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. We'd go for a week. Mm-hmm. And then we would do a comedy show. We'd take people shopping. With Paulette and yeah, Hawaii yeah, Hawaii Federal, Federal Like a Credit traveling? Union. Like yeah. people yeah. buy so, packages? So every yeah. year, people would buy a package to yeah. come hang out with us. And every morning, yeah. we broadcasted from a yeah. huh. suite. Then we and went you in went the on bus. a bunch of them. We went on a bus. We went shopping. And then you yeah. guys would be like the tour guides, remember? Yeah. Oh, you guys hit the outlets for and the we'd, local And we would make up our own. Make up their own. What do you mean make up your own? Like a tour guide on the bus. Yeah. So Augie had his bus. I had my bus. Right, yeah. and then we would do our thing yeah. get through the day, and then you know that was uh, actually that was funny. We did that for like fifteen years. Really, yeah. every year. What packaging? What is it? What panda? Ex- who, no, who? vacations Hawaii. Oh, vacations yeah. Hawaii yeah. ones. Oh, yeah. with the coupons. So it was like fly with Lanai and Augie yeah, yeah, to yeah, Vegas, yeah, yeah. and we they 
it'd be exhausting because it'd be exhausting. you would be with everybody all day and then all the younger guys would you go to the, take you to the club uh. so you'd be in the club till four in the morning right. and then you go on the air at nine o'clock because yeah. right. in hawaii time it was six yeah. o'clock so right that, yeah it was a grind yeah. well the, all, a lot of early morning activity was going on uh, i mean yeah it is vegas then you could bring like your dates up in the elevator right. th- in the building Do you know what <laughs> The, your dates. The, is that what we're talking said about? To say? Dates? He would hook us up with dates. Dates. Yeah, he just said, dates? just call him your date. Like. Like girls. Oh, okay. Chicks. Oh, call him your dates. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. As I, opposed I to what would you? Uh, no, I would invite. It kind of rhymes with. It kind of rhymes with constitution. Friends. Um. <laughs> but it's oh, no. not. It wasn't constitution. Now he's making up stories. He he I would invite a bunch of friends uh-huh. to come and hang out with I'm us. Sorry, should I put in the quotes? No, I would invite a bunch of friends to hang out with us. And mm-hmm. Champ would embarrass me and be like, "So what time do we have mm-hmm. to return, you guys?" I'm like, "They're yeah. not prostitutes. They're my uh, friends from I Hawaii." I swear they were. <laughs> I, I don't know. All I know. Now yeah. all the girls that went on those trips are like, "Wait, what? Yeah. He thought I was." All a I what? know, he my went in the God. room. He came out. He was sweating. This I is don't know his, what happened. This is his first time on a on a good show, and this is his last. <laughs> yes. Yeah. What kind of show is this? <laughs> we have a gift for you before you leave. Oh yes. Oh, really? um, yeah, we have the extended version of this show on our YouTube channel, YouTube's so you can you can watch. Um, should, should we have them open it right now? We can. We got a, a gift for you from yeah. 88 Tees. 88 Tees. Oh, wow. Yeah. Wow. It's very very cool. Wow. Yeah. And the bag. And the bag. You can yeah. keep the bag. Wow. Look at well, the when bag. When we're done, you gotta give the bag back. The <laughs> rainbow. <laughs> wow. Just you're on so your, classy. On your way out, give the bag back. You're so classy. Not on, ca- not on camera. All right. Uh, thank you to 808. Thank you, man. brother, for coming in. No, thanks, man. I love you, man. I'm so happy it. that you're still alive. Me check, too. Check out the Champ Show. It's on uh, uh, Spectrum OC16. And uh, hey, he does weddings and stuff. But if you want to hire him uh, for a wedding or a party or whatever, I'm actually cheaper. <laughs> yeah. Check us out on the long I version. I can corroborate on that. YouTube. It's a Hawaii thing. Welcome back to It's a Hawaii Thing, the extended version. YouTube. We're here uh, with Champ Kaneshiro, MC, comedian, stand-up. He does all kinds subscribe, of cool things. Subscribe, like, subscribe, He's like. He's a professional golfer. What's your handicap now? 13. Are you, are you he, allowed to ask that in 13. these woke days? 13. Yeah, yeah, it's a, okay. it's a term that we use 12, in golf. 13. <laughs> That's kind of high. <laughs> I mean, you've been go- how long have you been golfing? He's confident <laughs> with the low blows, no, like, bro. Like, it's like he says, what are you benching wow. now? I tell, him, I tell him 300. He goes, Slaps. 305. Wow. <laughs> how long have you been doing golf? How long have you been playing? I've been playing golf since the 80s, man. And you still suck. Yeah. Well, you, you think, it's a tough game. You know, after oh. you do it for a while, you get better. No, the people who do it for the love of it don't care what the numbers are. Well, They're obviously. like soul gar- golfers. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? He yeah. did it so, he's doing yeah. it so much, he got a heart attack Once, on the course. Yeah. Yeah. Too soon, My, buddy. Yeah. Dad died on the course with a heart attack. So the I was thinking hole, I was huh? down that yeah, same hole. No. Yes. Second hole. At the was same, it the same course? The same no, course. different course. Okay. But it was on hole two? Hole two. That's wow. crazy. He was on the green. I was halfway to the green. Wow. You think he's, he's, did you see him? Who, him? Yeah, when you're in the hospital, did you see him? No. Him, no. capital H, him, like, or him, like you? your dad? No, him. like yeah. I said, my feet was hot. <laughs> I didn't see I didn't see anything. <laughs> oh, nothing, man. Nothing. I was out. Yeah. So, yeah, I'm just glad to be alive, man. What do you like about doing stand-up comedy? Uh, Just seeing to get, you know, just seeing if you can, Im- you know, affect them. Yeah. You know, see if, if you can... Get him to. Lanai's been going through an existential life crisis lately about his stand up because he thinks people are too sensitive now and he can't really unleash like he used to. So we've been working through it in his um, here at the show. Okay. My, my, my therapy session. Yeah. Okay. But I've been doing it again. I know. I've you got back up on the horse. Yeah. Go ahead. Try. No, no, no. We're just talking about in general. Like, you, you, I mean, we talked about this too the other day. You have to. Everyone's really sensitive about stuff. So if you screw up, they're gonna put on social media, and then yeah. you're done. Yeah. yeah. At, if you, you watch I mean? the trajectory you, of yeah. our shows, at some point he literally was like, "I'm done. I'm never gonna yeah. do it again. I can't yeah. do it. I can't do it anymore." And then he was at the Blue Note. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Well, yeah. so you, you do that to polish up on some things, but yeah, yeah. If, you know, the crowds are different. Yeah. Way we, different. Wednesday night, you know, we had first show. We had a lot of mainland people. Yeah. Second show, we had a few mail-in people, not too much locals actually. You gonna start doing more uh, with Jose stand-up? Yeah, I try not to. <laughs> I, I mean, you know, if you're being honest, yeah. well, you know, some things can affect your. But you right. can't leave. You can't. You can't stop doing it. No, no, because no. you need just, attention. No, no, I just like. Why do you like to do it? It's God's gift. It's his calling, really, as it's Oprah says. You find your lane. 
Yeah. And yeah. you stay in your lane. She didn't give you the whole gift, huh? No. 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 <laughs> See, that's why golf is it's not a gift. It's the low-lying fruit at this point, buddy. <laughs> Just talk to me. Just hey. ignore him. Yeah. Just yeah. ignore him. He does this to me all day. Does he? Because no. yeah. he's Golf, really looking very chance. nice yeah. right Golf now. Golf is a passion. It's not a gift. His wife is here. I still got to look for the ball <laughs> when I hit it. So it's not a gift. Uh huh. But what we do, I think, I believe, is Oh, don't God, add me in this because I, I couldn't do what you guys your God do. Your God-given gift. Yeah. No, you do what we do. Yeah. I don't just do what you're you guys do. I have in a different way. too much respect for c- comedians. No, 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 not no, stand-up no, com- comedy. But oh. yeah. what, what you do with your voice. Uh, yeah. What you Got do it. with Host. You know, right. your, yeah, hosting. Got it. You know, engaging with people, helping. That's Right. You know, I've learned it's the one thing you do with the least amount of effort is your God-given gift. Yeah. So. And then if you can get paid to do it. You know, win, that's win. why I do it. Yeah. <laughs> but you know, for you, the money, it's easy gas money. Uh, no, okay. I, I, I wouldn't do it for the money because the pay is nothing. It's nothing. Yeah, for yeah. I mean, I'm just really like, because you've not done it for the money no. many, many times. Yeah. So yeah. Right. you know what's show. funny is the guy who's been booking us, he used to open for us, mm-hmm. and we used to pay him. Mm. Now he pays us. Yeah, now uh, he pays not a lot. <laughs> it's like not a, a lot, s- but yeah. Now I know. Now I know. Right. Now I know what we paid him. You're right. He's just paying us back. Look at that. Here, how's it feel to get 75 bucks? <laughs> Don't fuck it, huh? But if you break it down, 75 bucks for 20 minutes is pretty much like a doctor. No, it is. Or a lawyer. 10 minutes. Or a hooker. Yeah. It's just well, a it travel. depends what street you're on. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. River Vegas Street, it might be a little Vegas. bit cheaper. I don't, okay. yeah. Yeah. I don't know nothing about that. No, you're okay. a grandfather, aren't you? Yeah. Nine times soon. Nine. Yeah. Wow. Nine times this uh, July will be nine. You feel old? old? No, man. That's why, you know what's weird is like. They you know, keep you young. You figure my dad died when he was 50. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. I was 19. When you look at 19 to 50, that 31 years, you've seen, well, yeah. he was old. I'll be 58 this year. It's you like, are you going to be 58? You're in your, you're in your prime, man. Yeah. Are you going to be 58? You, 50, I said 55. What are you, 51? F- yeah. Yeah. Are you 51, really? Yeah. Oh, that's right. I said, f- but I said you you're were 55. You're in your prime still. You look I mean, good, man. You too. <laughs> yeah. You know, I still got my hair, you know. So that's ahead of him. So That, looks, yeah. that, does, that look like plugs to me. <laughs> no. No. But they really do look like plugs, though. They Somebody asked like. me if you had real hair. Really? Yeah, sure. Because sure, it's he's Okinawan, so it's like hard, stiff hair. Yeah, but I also lived in Los Angeles for thirty years or so, so I can you can't spot be that plugs. plugs. I can spot plugs. No, but if it was from like a away. distance, you kind of looks like you got plugs. No. I plug your can I, <laughs> can I say plug your ass? I don't think you should get plugs. I don't think you should say that out loud, oh. and especially in front of your wife. Here. Oh. <laughs> so she's heard it all. You went to you went to Radford. Radford. You said what you did, what did you play sports in? Uh, Eighty one was a good year. I wrestled. You wrestled. wrestled. Yeah. But your well, ears wait. are fine. Let me see. Like yeah. 80, well, no. 80 pounds. Yeah. How heavy in high 100. school? 100 pounds? 100. You'd wake up at 106. Oh. And you spit all Shishi day. doodle. Yeah, 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 and then pow. Then and you, you got to get weight. down to 100. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Did you, how, how, how successful were you? Not bad. But my senior year, I realized that it was easier for me to compete and win in powerlifting than it was in wrestling. So I chose um. powerlifting my senior year and uh-huh. left the wrestling team. And, uh, you know. The rest is history. The rest is history. Become champ. I See? became champ. How'd you get the name? Uh, I was... Cribbage, no, sorry, I was cribbage champ, Trump champ. <laughs> Not the Trump yeah, yeah, Trump, yeah, 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 yeah. but you know, I got Trumps, triggered. Trumps. I got triggered. Uh, yeah, I, I saw that. <laughs> <laughs> uh, chess champ, cribbage. You yes. don't play cribbage. I play cribbage. You play cribbage? No. It's one of the greatest games in the cribbage. world. I'm even Monopoly champ. I like Monopoly. Okay. Yeah. I don't like Monopoly. I like hey, it. I'll take all of that Baltic and the. Yeah, you know, I the take continent. all the slums too. Yeah. 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 And yeah. just bang them. You come around that corner, brother. <laughs> 250, bro. <laughs> you know, you're running hotels, bro. Hotels, hotels, hotels. You owe me 250, bro. Yeah, I get it. I love that too. Yeah. So, <laughs> and uh, arm wrestling champ, powerlifting champ. And so you gave yourself the name. Somebody gave me this name a long time ago. My buddy Paul Hayes. He goes, man, you know what, man, you're the fucking, you're you're, you're the champ. Yeah. You know, just like you. You know when you, you left the station. Yeah. And people say, what are you gonna do now? You know, winners win, right? Winners win. And so, you what's your name? Still what? trying. <laughs> That's my. That's you my nickname. It's Lanai still trying to bore. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. No, he's doing it. That's we'll what find says. a Hawaiian version of that. Yeah. So we give you a Hawaiian version yeah. of that. <laughs> How'd you Hanaho. Lanai Hanaho Tabura. Uh, trying again for the third time. 
You have questions for Miss Universe? Yeah, man. Oh, know, is this math involved math? No. no. She's not good at math, yeah. so don't ask math yeah. questions. Are, are you back home? This is home this every is, day now. This has always been home, yes, but okay. I now reside here. Okay, because you was in the mainland. For very long Because I remember when we were doing radio, you would call or she would She was on the show all the time. I believe yeah. right? the legal term was stalking, but oh, yes. <laughs> yeah, yeah. He called it dating. You okay. call it stalking. Yeah, no, yeah. Remember? Felipe. There was a, there was, did I mention this to you? I just found the article. I was going to bring it in. Um, what was his name that did the entertainment column? Which one? There's Wayne, Wayne, Wayne Harada. Wayne Harada. John, Wayne Harada. John Berger didn't like music and stuff. Okay. Wayne Harada did that entertainment column. Yeah. Nobody ever wrote me You up. came home. None. Really? Yeah. Yeah, because you, you're you still working on that. Yeah. That's why you got on the show. Watch. Yeah. Everything's going to change after yeah. today. Is it really? Change? Yeah. Okay. Everything's going to wow, change. Wow, it's a lot of pressure. anybody watch this show? A lot of pressure. A lot of pressure. Anyway, we went, you took me to your, it was your high school reunion or something. Uh-huh. Or it was the Kamehameha Schools reunion. Yeah. And there was, everyone was there. Like right. the who's who that was, was there. That was probably the tenure. And then Right after days, I had given up the title. Two days later, oh. yeah. it was in the paper. You don't remember this? I don't. You, well, I wasn't oh, you living, were living here. here. So. I got to go find it. It said that uh, I think Miss Universe, Brooke Lee, and Lanai are Got something thing. going on. Yeah, you remember? I remember that so rumor. Because they were talking yeah, about it on the radio and yeah, everybody. Yeah. He was like spreading rumors like you guys was going to hook <laughs> no, up. I didn't spread the rumor. Something like really? that. But Wayne was there. At mm. the event, somebody and did. he was, he did it. You know, his column like who was there, yeah. who sang and entertained, right. and then at the end of it or something, it was me. And then people were talking about it on the radio. I never believed. And by you people, were always, you mean you because you no, were on no, the radio. Other radio stations. Oh, I never because believed you it. were on coming on the show once a week or whatever. Uh, so they, yeah. they uh, fit, you know, <laughs> we were a thing. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, it was a it wow. was yeah. gossip. Gossip. It yeah. was good gossip. Wow. Uh, unbelievable. I never I believed no it. Idea. It helped the ratings. So I, I said, went with hell it. no. Okay. Hell no. <laughs> no way. <laughs> <laughs> no way. Champ the voice you of must reason. Be, you must be on your way down. <laughs> you know what it helped with so me funny. was because during that time, a lot of people thought I was Mahu. A is lot that of not still a pervading thing? No. Probably still is, but <laughs> okay. at that time, because you do own Scarlet. Yeah, so. at that time, it was a lot of people thought for some re for some reason I don't know why. I mean, not that that's a bad thing. Not at all, but, but I, I do wasn't. think that if you're hanging out with beauty queens, yeah. that doesn't help your street cred. Yeah, maybe that's what maybe <laughs> well, that's what it was. This guy definitely had some beautiful women in his that's life. That's what? Who else said that? Unbelievable. Uh, the that drummer. That doesn't mean anything. Well, no. he's got well, two no, beautiful Ernie, daughters. Ernie, it Ernie does. Reyes Jr. said that too. He's like, oh, Lanai, yeah. every time I see you, you always got the bevy of beauties yeah. around you. What's that Either about? Got, so I feel Either smart. Drug so I feel the smartest. Drug. So we thought he was dealing drugs. <laughs> How does he get these chicks? This the must pretty be dealing drugs. No. Need the extra candy right. of a Debbie. No, he used to say that because they have money. money. Yeah, 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 you know what I mean? And we're gold diggers, evidently as well. Hey, did you ever Google your net worth? Don't do this. Google I can't do Google this. I'm not emotionally on prepared. On, uh, on, uh, That's, how, they don't even on know. He, no. no, wait till you find out how much. He says the social media is lied. Watch this lie. Okay. How much you worth? So, how much you so worth? So I thought for years, why people always ask me for money? Because if you Google me, my net worth is $13 million. Yeah. Really? Yeah, guess and what Brooks is. No, 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 no. Let's start. $59 million. Let's start with then Moani came on the show. Oh, yeah, the Moani came on And then they the Googled Moani, and Moani was like 1.3 yeah. or something. And then they Googled me, and it was like $200,000. $150 and <laughs> a Tic Tac. How much? Nine hundred thousand, champ. Your net worth. You're more than me. <laughs> <laughs> I need a new team. I, I, I need more you people. You need a new manager I and a publicist. That pisses me off media. that I'm worth more than you. Yeah, I'm because like, you are worth way more than me. Yeah, we all. I'm know gonna that. have to start selling my Hawaiian jewelry. Wow. It's gonna get ugly. Hey. So now you know your net worth. Now you know. Let's see. But none of us are as much as Lanai. No. That's just so ridiculous. No, who do you pay? Thing. He is. You got a guy. You always got a you guy. You know, I know. I don't know how to log on to the internet. That's what are you true. talking about? I know. Why that's true. Net worth went up. <gasps> Did it? One to five million. One point five million. They heard one. you. Whoa. Well, one to five. Million. Oh, got it. See, wow. see what this show does for you. Hey, watch what happens in a couple months. Thanks, BTS Army, for getting on that. Watch you guys did a letter writing campaign and got my net worth the up. The BTS Army, are you part of that? She I is. am. I am. <gasps> Man, they got like a trillion hits yeah. on their song. And they got McDonald's. Again, I was thinking when they came with that shirt. That mask I got you was a B, that gold BTS, BTS black mask. and yeah, so yeah. I thought maybe that might be a my BTS baby girl in Texas. Who is BTS. your bias for BTS? Who's your fave? The rapper. 
Uh, oh, there's okay. three rappers Wait. in the rap line. No. So you rap really need to... uh, I, I is that rap name. monster, the tall one that speaks English? I don't know. It's whoever my daughter's favorite is. Because oh, so if it's, it's sugar, so you're, I'll you're, fight you're her. not a BTS. No, your I am. I listen are. to Dynamite every day, man. <laughs> you only know one song. Well, it's, it's the one, the one they to sing know. in English. If you're oh, gonna know goodness. one, that's one. Yeah. You know. Do we have to go? We do. Why huh? do you keep asking that? We're on YouTube. We own We're the not. station. We no, could... because we have a ne we have a guest after this. Whatever. Oh, yeah. Really? I want yeah. Champ to I, stay. I can see they're not he early. He should be All like right. our we, backup. You can come back. Host. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. yeah, whenever Brooke's sick, you can come back. No, whenever yeah. Lanai's sick, you can come <laughs> you, on anytime you want. You're welcome to come back if I'm sick. Do yeah. you go to Utah? I don't, and I'm oh. a bad Mormon. Why, I really? should go to Utah more often. What's up with Utah? I only oh, go there for there. Sundance. I've got a lot of Mormon friends. Where did that Mormons. come up from? I've actually, just, just, just it's just oh. to, you know, yeah. change the conversation. Establish to, yeah. a repertoire. Trying to boost right. your ratings here, man. I have some Mormon Well, if you want to boost your ratings, then you should come harder. Oh. And be more entertaining. You're gonna have wow. to cut that part out, Kurt. I'm yeah. gonna tell you straight <laughs> up, Kurt. straight up. Yeah. His Straight name is up. Champ Kaneshiro. Follow Thank him on you. Instagram. He loves doing those live Thank Instagram you. things. One hashtag champ. Yeah. One. Oh yeah. What's well, so. not? It's one. Hashtag, no, no. It's hashtag, at one champ. At one champ. At one. We'll thank put it on you. the screen. <laughs> hey, thank you for doing uh, what you do, brother. Making people laugh. Thanks for coming on the show. Love you, man. Thank you for the We're looking forward man. to traveling this more with you this year. Oh, what a champ Kaneshiro, ladies and gentlemen. It's a Hawaii thing. Shoot. It's a Hawaii.